I am believing God for miracles every day. When I found out that WET cared about children in crisis, I said, sign me up, I'm in. We cannot change the whole world, but we can change the world of somebody somewhere. A lot of people ask what WEC stands for. WEC stands for Worldwide Evangelization for Christ. Mm -hmm. We, uh, we kind of joke ourselves as it stands for We're Everyone's Crazy because we say, you know, we're everyone's crazy about Jesus and about these communities of faith coming into being. It's a large vision that we have for developing a multi-ministry center that includes camps, that includes as a conference center, that includes missionary training, that includes uh, pastoral retreats. And it's so much bigger than, than, than me. <laughs> we serve a big God, and He's looking for people with a bold faith that will follow Him. My contribution to WEC is in the area of training, where we encourage each one to be a lifelong learner and to continually upgrade their skills and understanding and knowledge. God has given me a chance to see children all around the world go from children in crisis to children in Christ. I've seen him take a little street boy, take him off the street, put food in his belly, clothes around him, and he learned Jesus. And you could not ever tell that boy anything different. He knew Christ for life. Our candidate orientation is something we intend to be transformational. This is something we ask the Lord for, that it'll be transformational to really prepare people individually for what the Lord knows is ahead of them on the field. The fellowship we enjoy with each other is more like being part of a family. We are really loved and taken care of and uh, we are not just led by ourselves. We are really uh, committed one to the other. It's so exciting to see kids like street kids or child soldiers or even the sexually exploited ones, so horrible. But yet, to help them to have a productive life, to go from havoc to hope, to children in Christ, and, and to see them come to know Jesus and be such an asset to the kingdom. It's so beautiful. I was the only doctor for 175,000 people and uh, yeah, we just shared the love of Christ with people. It was a Muslim area, and we just showed the love of Christ, and I took care of their physical needs, and when they asked about our spiritual lives, we shared our spiritual lives with them as well, and it was a beautiful time. We were there 13 years. Our kids grew up there, and uh, I think we really made a difference. It certainly made a difference in our lives, and I think it made a difference in Chad In's lives. We really liked how intentional WEC was and their process in which they prepared you to go to the field and also followed up uh, and also uh, reaching unreached people groups because uh, Christ needs to be preached everywhere. I think that now more than ever, because people are becoming more aware of what's going on in the entire world, that there's more opportunity for us to go out and move to those needs and those people and just really just love on them. And so I did. I, um, in the process of being in Bulgaria, I really saw the need for Christ. Um, and realize that no amount of money in the world is going to fix people, um, and no theory or philosophy is going to fix people um, outside of the gospel. We serve a big God, and He's looking for people with a bold faith that will follow Him.